Beautiful. All right. Uh, this is a sensitive topic. I understand that. It's going to piss a lot of people off. I understand that. You shouldn't take it so seriously. I'm half joking. I'm sorry if it really fucking offends you, but I really don't think it should. I think it's a fucking funny joke. <clears throat> there are people who say that they want to help people, and so they become a doctor. But not all doctors are the same. You know what I mean? There's plenty of different types of doctors. You can become anything. If you want to help someone truly, you know, just be like a pediatrician or like, you know, help old people. I don't know. Just like be a cancer doctor. You know what I mean? Like if you're, if you're just about helping people, just be something straight up just helping people. The problem is there's doctors for weird sexual shit too. You can be a fucking vagina expert and you can be a fucking butthole expert. And that's fucking ridiculous. It's fucking creepy. How the hell are you supposed to devote your entire life to just the butthole? And like, act like that's not creepy as shit. It's fucking weird. Pussy ass vagina experts. Weird as shit too, bro. Weird as shit. All I know is if I had a vagina, hell no, I'm not going to some fucking male doctor. Hell no. Hell no. Picture this. You're little kid you're terrified you don't want to go to the doctor you're not even sick but for whatever reason society says no no get a checkup get a checkup doesn't matter if you're not sick just pay for the checkup what you're paying for is to get diddled by your doc the diddle doc he fucking does the checkup he checks your your heart rate your <coughs> your breathing make sure everything's good and then it's time for the show let's dim the lights Throw on some Marvin Gaye, let's get it on. Pulls down the trousers. Cup the balls, feel them. Make sure they feel good. <laughs> Sniff them. Make sure they're got the right stench going. And then give you a little kiss on the forehead and tell you that they look great. It's ridiculous, it's ridiculous. How is that shit normal? Like you couldn't just ask me if there's anything wrong with my balls? I, like, I know I'm a little kid, but still, for crying out loud, I think I would know if there's some fucked up shit in my balls. Yeah, and that's and that's just the pediatricians going after your balls. I mean, like, I get it. Like, it's just part of the job. They tell them they gotta do it, but they know they have to do it before they ever start the job. How can they just ignore that? How can and no one is standing up saying, like, do we really have to touch the kid's balls? No one's saying that shit. They're all just, like, accepting it. And yeah, if you're like a guy who's becoming an OBGYN, oh my god, oh my god, what are you doing, dude? What are you, like, dude, just, just go watch my other video about how to get laid. Don't, don't devote your whole life to, you know, fucking, <laughs> to, I don't know, becoming like, freaking pussy expert who's like legally allowed to just inspect your pussy up close. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Leave that shit to women. They're the fucking pussy experts. They fucking have that shit. The fuck makes you a pussy expert, bro? You should be a fucking dick expert, you creep. Also, buttholes? What? You think that shit's normal? You're gonna be checking out buttholes, bro? Come on. Stay away from my fucking hole. And, like, if you're going in my butthole, like, I have to invite you. I have to know you. You gotta take me out to dinner first. Like, get comfortable with me. Ask me some questions about me. Like, I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't seem right. It seems rushed. I'm just not ready. Like, and what does it take? How, how, is it just a checkup for that shit? Or, like, do you have to be, like, sick? I don't know. How do you even get a sick butthole? What is that? Stay away from my butthole. It's a sacred place. Not for you. Shit's fucked up. Yeah. I mean, those dudes are basically just creeps with degrees. Yes, I went to college. Yes, I went to medical school. Yes, I'm still a creep. I'm a creep with a degree. Creep with a degree. Creep with a degree. Give me your butthole. Give me your pussy. Give me your balls. I want them all. Yeah, that's your doctor. That's your doctor. The next time you like think about taking your fucking son or daughter to the to the doctor for a checkup it's not just a checkup that doctor is checking your kid up and down 
He's getting a good fucking lip. He's biting his lip. He's salivating. Fuck. That's a nice set of balls. This shit happens. I know what happens. I've been, I've been there in the back of those doctor office waiting rooms. I know what it's like. I know the stress. I know the fear. Stay away from my balls, bro. Stay away from our kids' balls. Come on now. Anyways, that's all I got. I gotta go. I got a date with my uh, my pediatrician. I've been dating for 20 years now, and he gives a hell of a rim job. So yeah. <laughs>